in the crest gate on Adam shown, surface AB forms the arc of a circle of 3 meter radius, subtending 45 degrees at the hinge. The gate is 3 meters long. With water surface at B, compute the amount and location of the horizontal and vertical components of the total pressure on AB. So this is the figure. Then since the water surface is level with B, it's easy to locate the horizontal force. It is one third of the height because the pressure at the level of the top of the gate is zero. So the pressure diagram here would be triangular. So the height of the gate of this vertical projection because we draw horizontal line through the endpoints of the curve and that's the net height of the of the vertical projection of the area to be analyzed is 3 sine of 45. So that's 3 sine 45. The gate is 3 meter long. So that's why this is 3 meters. So F8, that's the location. It's below the centroid. And therefore, this is one third of 3 sine 45. The height is 3 sine 45 and it is level with plus with the water surface. So we don't need to solve for E sub V. This is one third of 3 sine 45 or 0 0.7071 meter. Then we draw for the vertical component, we draw lines through the endpoints up to the liquid surface, water surface. So at A, we stop here. At B, we do not draw vertical line anymore because this is already the liquid surface. Then the volume to be considered is the volume bounded by the curve this vertical line here, point B, and this water surface. So this is the volume to be considered. And this volume is area of the shape times 3 meters. Now this area is equal to area of trapezoid. Can you see the trapezoid here? Then less the area of the sector. Now the length of this side is 3 minus, this is 3 cosine 45. So that's FV. This is the resultant, and since this is circular, the resultant passes through C. Let's use that uh, principle or idea so that we can easily locate FV instead instead of centroid of area or volume. So this is, as I said, three meters minus this length is, or this length here, this one is 3 cosine of 45. So this is 3 cosine 45. So 3 minus 3 cosine 45 is 0 0.8787. Then let's call that x sub a because we specify the line of action of FH from a. It's already specified sine 45 or 0 0.7071 uh, xa. So the moment arm of FV from C is 3 minus xa. So F8 is specific weight of water barred H, which is 3 sine 45 over 2, and the area is 3 times 3 sine 45. So F8 is equal to 66.22 kilonewtons, and it is sine 45 or 0 0.707 meter above A. So we have answered F8. FV. FV is equal to specific weight of water times volume. The volume is equal to area of trapezoid minus area of sector with central angle 45 degrees. 45 degrees in radians is pi over 4 or 0 0.25 pi. Then times perpendicular to the board 3 meters. So this is just the net area times 3. Substitute FV is 9.81 quantity 1 half or 0.5 of quantity uh, 0.8787 plus 3 times height 3 sine 45. That's the area of the trapezoid. Area of sector is 1 half radius square times central angle in region. So 1 half is 0.5 radius square 3 square central angle pi over 4 in regions 45 degrees is pi over 4. Then quantity times 3. So F sub V is equal to 17.06 kilonewtons. Then Moment of the resultant force about the center of the circular arc is at C is zero. 
it passes through there. Therefore, it is equal to the sum of the moments of its components. So it is equal to 0. MC is 0 equals FV, which is 17.06. The moment arm is 3 minus XA. Then minus FH, which is 66.22. The moment arm is sine 45 degrees or 0 0.7071. So solving for XA, X66.22, 3 minus 66.22 times 0 0.7071 divided by 17.06. So x sub a is 0.2553 meter. Therefore, Fv is 17.06 kilonewtons, 0.2553 meter to, right, to the right of point a. So that's it for this problem.